Hey there, hey there, hey there, Kaz here, and today I'm here to do an unbagging of Tokyo Quiet Club. Tokyo Quiet Club is a monthly subscription package. It costs roughly about 30, sometimes even 40 something pound a month. I've been with this for a long time and I've had some really lovely stuff from it. Some of the stuff is so unique. Um, basically, it's run by a guy that's called Michael Donahue. He lives in Tokyo. And basically, you will go on his website. And join up on the mailer, he will send you an email asking for a list of your favourite Disney characters. You send him a list of your favourite Disney characters, he will go to Tokyo Disneyland, Tokyo Disney Sea, and the Tokyo Disney Store, and he will buy you five to six items to do with those characters that are on your list. You can make the list as long as you want. The bigger the list is, the more like different characters you will get, and you may never get like a repeat of a character if the list is long enough. Like, I've been with this for a very, very long time. And like I said before, I love it. I've had some really lovely stuff from it. Some of the stuff is so unique. And I'm just a very big fan. So we'll just get right in here. We've got something on the top that's quite squishy. So we'll just take that out first. Oh. It looks like a little pillow of some sort it's from the Disney Resorts. It doesn't really say what it well it does, but that is very sweet. It's got Mickey on one side, and if we flip it over, we have Minnie. It's just like a little squidgy cushion, and it's got like the hats that you can buy over at Disneyland. That's really sweet. I like that. I don't know what I'll use it for, but I like the pattern. I like really soft and squishy so it's always good right what do we have next it's all in a little bag I don't think there's anything else in there they all come in like different kind of bags it depends if there's a special event going on this is just your typical Tokyo Disney Resort bag where you have Mickey on one side Minnie on the other and it's got like a few of the rides and stuff on it I'll just dig on in here, see what we have. Go something small first. Oh, it's a Simsum. It's a goofy Simsum. I think this is for um, the Lunar New Year that's happening over there right now. I'm not too sure. Don't come at me, guys. I'm, I'm not really up to scratch with what's happening over in Tokyo right now. But it's a cute little goofy Simsum. I have so many Simsums from this. But they are just the sweetest little things ever. Goofy is one of my many favourite Disney characters. So it's always nice to get something of him. Okay. Oh. oh, cool! This is Chopsticks, but they're of the aliens from Toy Story. Now anybody who's watched my videos knows that I absolutely adore the aliens from Toy Story. They are the sweetest little things ever. And they always, they just make me laugh because of the way they are. And these are little chopsticks. I'll open them up and show you them. If I can find out where to open them. It seems to be damn packaging. There we are. I don't know if these are usable or whether they're just for like the ones that you may be like popping your hair. But they're like green plastic and they've got pictures of the aliens. And like the little planet. Some pizza planet. Those are really sweet. I don't think you'd be able to use them to eat though. I think they're sheerly just for decoration. Like maybe you could like put up your hair really pretty and pop them in the back of it. Because I've, I've seen some people do that. So. I'm very happy with those because... Like I've said a million trillion times, I love the aliens from Toy Story. Go for something else. 
I'm looking for like small things, but there doesn't really seem to be small things in here. Marvel 80 Years Coaster Set. Oh, now that is cool. We'll get these open, see what they look like. Oh. I just seem to be having a problem with packaging today. <laughs> really should have like a little pen knife or something to open stuff up. Yeah, they're just like your typical, hmm, they're not very good quality. They, I wouldn't use these. They, they feel like just like really thin cardboard. If you got anything on those, they'd be ruined in seconds. So I don't think it would be worth using them. I might display them, but I definitely won't be using them. Marvel established in 1939. I've got like a little cartoony strip, which is pretty sweet. Quite a lot of the characters on there. And then we have an orange one of the Marvel 1939. That's pretty cool. It's very rare I get anything to do with Marvel in these. Um, but when I get it, I'm always happy to get it, no matter what it is. <coughs> and I think there's maybe just two items left. So we'll go for this one. Oh! I think these are, like, wet wipes or something. They, they have the prettiest packaging ever. Little Dumbo. That is sweet. I could never use them because to use them you have to rip off the front and it completely ruins the picture and that picture is just too adorable. Those are sweet. I like them. They come in handy. So there's one more thing. Oh, this is the sweetest. Is there anything else in here? No. Nope. Oh, look at that. <laughs> It's like a little pouch. I don't know if you can see it because it's quite a pale colour. It's a very pale purple. And it's got a little scrump, a little stretch in his hammock. That is the sweetest. And the little, this little palm tree on the zip. I think it's just like a little pouch that you can like put stuff in. And it's got the little note. Keep staying safe and awesome from Michael. He always pops a little note in there. It's really sweet because it makes it really personal. But yeah, that's all I got in this mailer. I am very happy with it. It's very sweet stuff. A little alien and adorable little stitch pouch. If you like this video, hit that subscribe button, slap that like button. I'll see you again next time. Bye bye.